Ladies and gentlemen, today's topic is abortion. What we're going to do today, ladies and gentlemen, is uh, a particular topic that came up uh, uh, across YouTube and um, dealing with uh, a very serious matter uh, such as abortion. And um, I'm going to play the video, and I want you to. Um, I want you to see the video for yourself and look at it, critique it, and you know, just, um, you all know what's happening and you all know the truth and, you know, this, this is actually real life issues, you know, uh, this video, this video I came across on YouTube is, um, it's quite disturbing and, um, we're gonna, we're gonna have a look at the video and we're gonna, um, you're gonna actually uh, think and judge for yourself, or maybe not judge, but um, you know, reflect, and and you know, you don't have to leave your comments or anything. We're not we're not gonna analyze the video. We're not gonna go through it and and talk about it. You're just gonna watch it, and um, at the end of the day, you decide uh, uh, what's what's right and what's wrong. So let's, without further ado, let's have a look at the video. Since 1973, legal abortion has killed more African Americans than AIDS, cancer, diabetes, heart disease, and violent crime combined. Every week, more blacks die in American abortion clinics than were killed in the entire Vietnam War. And the largest chain of abortion clinics in the United States is operated by Planned Parenthood. What? We have now reached a point in this country that African American women, though they make up 12% of the population, they account for 37% of the abortions. An African American baby is almost five times more likely to be aborted than a white child. The abortion industry at this point kills as many African American people every four days as the Klan killed in 150 years and you can truly say the most dangerous place for an african-american to be is in the womb of their african-american mother what? all across america you can stand outside of the abortion clinics and see a steady stream of black women coming in and out but somewhere along the way we got the idea that this is a white issue or a conservative issue or a Republican issue and therefore it's not an issue that we have to be concerned about. This same attitude has allowed Planned Parenthood and other members of the abortion industry to carry out this genocide right under our very noses. Right now in America about half of our babies are being killed in the womb and in certain parts of America more of our babies are being aborted than are being born. 